energy since the Suns clinched a finals appearance for the first time in decades. That energy is touching everyone, including local artists on Roosevelt Row, who are capturing how the community feels in this moment. Team 12's Nyala Charles is live from First Friday's Art Walk to show us those incredible masterpieces. Nyala. Yeah, well, we're right here on Roosevelt Row, and of course, the artists have been working hard on these murals for two days. The one getting the most buzz, though, this one right here of Devin Booker in front of the Golden Margarita. Actually, while the Suns won the Western Conference, the artists were here painting, watching it, and that win is reflected in a lot of their work. We were asked to do a mural of our choice, but we were like, Suns are doing so good, we gotta like rep our city. <laughs> Sabri Garcia was on Roosevelt Row in downtown Phoenix painting this mural as the Suns clenched the Western Conference victory. That contagious energy in downtown Phoenix. The energy, oh my gosh, was insane out here. Reflected with each stroke of purple and orange. I wanted it to be like a, a basketball fading into like cactus of like, just like as one. The unity also inspiring artist Bill Taggart. It's just been awesome to see the valley come together. Who made this portrait of the sun's number one man, Devin Booker and his dog Haven. I didn't want to just do like a, uh, a guy in his jersey. I wanted to show more a personal side. Taggart's painting getting two thumbs up from the sun's on social media with Booker signing off with a row of fire emojis. Pretty crazy, still kind of processing it all. That same feeling goes for Suns fans as they cheer on the Suns to the finals. If they win, like, I don't know, just better, like, energy for everybody. As you can see, celebrations are still going on strong here in downtown Phoenix on Roosevelt Road. Tons of people out here still bringing that energy with them from the Suns win. So this is the mural that we showed you during the story. Now it's done. So this is the end result. Again, the artist telling us that she really just wanted to capture the unity of the city. And we're experiencing that right now here on Roosevelt Row. We're live in downtown Phoenix. Nyla Charles, 12 News at 10.